Call me Ishigami. Ministry of Defense. External Affairs. A special agency within the Ministry. Think of us like you ninja. And? She will provide you with the details. Mizuki McLeod, Japan Air Self-Defense Force Special Security Unit. Flight Officer First Class. Yesterday, an unknown group launched a terrorist attack in London. They've taken control of the area around the Prime Minister's residence. So why me? What do you need my help for? <laughs> oh no. We don't need your help. You need ours. Mizuki, show him the video. This was just sent to us by the government. Bring us Ryu Hayabusa! Bring us Ryu Hayabusa! It's you they want. Ryu Hayabusa. Hayabusa, can you hear me? Yeah, go ahead. All civilians have been evacuated. Any armed soldiers down there are fair game. The hostages are in the Prime Minister's residence, right? Yes. I'll monitor the situation and guide you from the air. Be careful, Hayabusa. Wait! Something's there! been waiting for you, hero. Who are you? Let's dispense with the introductions and get straight to the killing, shall we? Come, Ryu Hayabusa. Manus de facto manu tua. Open your eyes, Ryu Hayabusa. So, how does it feel to suffer as all of your victims? No, no. We are both steeped in the blood of our countless victims, my brother. Farewell, until we meet again. Hayabusa, respond! disappointing. I had hoped the mighty dragon ninja would have put on more of a show. Uh, no matter. Begin the next phase. Yes, sir. Hayabusa! Can you hear me? Hayabusa! Come in! <laughs> <laughs> Hayabusa? Yeah. We're coming to pick you up. Good. I owe you one. Don't worry about it. What matters now is... 
What's the situation? The soldiers withdrew once the residence was destroyed. It appears you really were their objective. Mizuki, turn on the news. This new world has no need of nation-states. No need of avaricious, incompetent prime ministers, or presidents, or kings, or despots. Every nation, every country, must immediately agree to our terms of surrender. You have seven days, exactly the number of days it took God to create the world. Failure to comply will result in your immediate destruction. We did it to London, and we can do it to you. So this is what they were really after. See that high rise up ahead? It was abandoned in the middle of construction. As far as we can tell, the satellite transmission originated from that location. Then it was uploaded and distributed through hacked communication systems all around the world. Is that even possible? <laughs> if you had the entire world's resources at your fingertips, maybe. So who are these people? Whoever they are, they have access to some serious money. The UN has scheduled a crisis conference for today. They'll probably order the mobilization of emergency forces. HQ has told me to provide you with whatever support you need. Looks like we'll be working together for a while longer, Hayabusa. It does. This is as close as we can get by car without attracting attention. It's close enough. This was developed by our own engineers. It's still just a prototype. But... What is it? It's obviously not your dragon sword now, is it? This is a special bow that can lock onto a target. Should be easy enough for you to use, right? I've used bows before. Okay. Good luck. Remember, I'll be watching your back. Me to come. Jingra Maru. Word gets around fast. <laughs> Make sure you bring it back in one piece. It's just a loner. Okay. Tell Hayate I said thanks. You should have someone in the village take a look at that arm. I will. Soon. There's something I need to finish first. Take care. Are you there? Come in. Are you okay, Hayabusa? What's going on? I'm heading up. You still live, 
Ryu Hayabusa. Quite a fast response today. By Japanese government standards, anyway. Unfortunately for you, we're all done here. Who are you? Ah, an alchemist. Born again in the here and now. What do you mean? <laughs> Magnificent, isn't it? A skyscraper abandoned in the middle of construction. Like the Tower of Babel. Built so high, they incurred the wrath of God. What better backdrop for the beginning of the end of the world? I'm tired of your nonsense. You lack a sense of aesthetics, my friend. <sighs> After all, doesn't the art of your country teach you to appreciate austerity and the elegance of decay? <laughs> and speaking of decay, how's your arm? It's an old Slavic curse, you know. The grip of murder, they call it. The grip of murder. <laughs> All material things pass to their own frequency. The words of the curse resonated with the blade of your dragon sword, broke down its structure, then melted into your arm, together with all the malice and hate it encapsulated. <sighs> it was a simple spell to weave. Malice and hate? Think! Think! How many lives has that hand taken? Hundreds? Thousands? The blood of those you have cut down infused your sword, together with their vengeful hatred. Now, it's in your heart. Perhaps you can hear their sorrowful wails? Well, soon those cries will begin to rock your arm from the inside out. The infection will spread to the rest of your body, and that will be the end of you. Death will follow shortly. The only real question is, who will die first? You or the world? Damn you! You want to know who I am? I'm the same as you, Ryu Hayabusa. We're cut from the same cloth. Look at your right hand. That is the symbol of all the lives you have taken. All the people you have killed. Make no mistake. You are an assassin of the darkness. Enough! <laughs> <laughs> In the ruins of paradise, where the corpses of dreams lie rotting, what could be more fitting than a mirage? Yes, of course I'm an illusion, as is all existence. Nothing more than a collection of data points resonating in infinite expansion. But enough. The time to talk is at an end. War and strife is your fate. Death, your duty. Or am I wrong? Ha <laughs> ha! It has an exploding tip that'll blow up anything it hits. Tell me something. Sure. Are you using me to field test all your prototypes? No. It's just that I thought, well, there's this guy in our lab who's a bit mad and he... A bit mad? You don't mean me, do you? <laughs> if there were any others like you, this world would be in even more trouble than it already is. Kana! What are you doing here? You were supposed to be looking after her. Orders. Ishigami told me to come. He didn't order you to bring Kana along, did he? Didn't I tell you to stay at home and wait for me to come back? It's not safe for you here. You have to wait in a safe place until Mommy gets home. Do you hear me? She said she didn't want to be alone anymore. And besides, with this maniac on the loose, no place is safe. She's better off with us. What's done is done. You're here now. Is she your... I guess a few introductions are in order. Hayabusa, this is my daughter, Kana. It's alright, Kana. You don't have to be afraid of him. He may look kind of scary, but he's a good man. I'm not... scary. Hello, Kana. My name is Ryu. That means dragon. 
Kana, don't be so rude. I'm sorry, Hayabusa. No, no, it's, it's okay. I'm sorry for scaring her. Uh, ahem. Perhaps you could introduce me? Oh, right. Hayabusa, this is Clifford Higgins, a scientist with the Ground Self-Defense Forces Special Research Unit. That's all? What else is there? <laughs> Such love for her dearest brother-in-law. Anyway, hello. Call me Cliff. Your legend precedes you, you know. Nothing but stories. Perhaps. Perhaps not. In any case, it's a pleasure to meet you, Hayabusa. So, um, to business, shall we? We have identified the group behind the threat. You have? Yes. They're called the Lords of Alchemy. You actually know them better by their global conglomerate front, L.O.A. L.O.A.? They're heading for the presidential residence. The resistance won't hold out for much longer. You have to hurry. Well, well. I come to see what all the fuss is about. And look who I run into. Such a darling little heroine. This is as far as you go. Prepare to die! <laughs> Breaking in. Killing. Naughty. Time for your punishment, girl! <laughs> now it ends. <coughs> Don't even try to act all tough. <gasps> Warning. Missile strike commencing. Time until impact. May the unclean world 15, be 14, purified. 15, 12, <laughs> Seriously, you want to try not waiting until the last second to do that? So I hacked the transmission codes and got control of the communication satellite they were using. So I didn't really have to worry about death from above or whatever. I guess I'm done here, right? Not yet. Now we're going to find out who these people really are. Ryu's trying to figure that out too, but in his condition.
you're the only one I can count on. All right, fine. You can use me a little longer. Arriving at objective. I'm going in. Looks like he didn't notice. Whatever, I'm leaving. Don't get caught. I'm going offline. LOA, the toothbrushes to tanks, guys? The one and only. They used to be your average, massive, high-tech conglomerate, but ever since the economic crash and resulting industry shakedown, they diversified into manufacturing, well, anything and everything. After analyzing the weapons we seized, we realized they'd been secretly developed by LOA. No question about it. The fact is, if you've got technology, money, and a vision, you're pretty much invincible. It's always been that way. Ah, what I could do with the tiniest fraction of LOA's budget. Look at all these offices and affiliates. LOA has global reach. If anyone could control the mass media, it's them. So that means they could be behind this. The only question is, why would they go to the trouble? <laughs> Don't ask me, that's your job. Mizuki, I need you and Hayabusa on Abysmal Island at once. We think this is the location of LOA's secret lab. We don't have much of a window. Get going. Understood. LOA... Hey, listen. Watch your back with Ishigami. He's hiding something. Like what? This operation isn't sanctioned by any government. This is his little project. He's off the grid. No. Yes. The Americans know you and Hayabusa are on the move. And let's just say they aren't happy about it. Something's not right about this mission. Understood, Cliff. But regardless, we still have to check LOA out. I'm going. Okay. Just be careful out there. Mommy has some work to take care of. I'll be back soon, okay? You listen to Cliff while I'm away. Take care of her for me, Cliff. You got it. And this time, I won't let her out of my sight. Promise. Let's go, Hayabusa. Okay. <laughs> what is it? Of course. Her and you both. I promise, Kana. Come on, Hayabusa. Tell me about the dinosaurs. Ah! Clones! From fossil cells. Why? <laughs> Why? Business, of course! How many children would want a dinosaur as a pet? We could sell millions of the things! And the technology represents something even the richest man can't buy. Think about the potential of cloned organs. Or cloned young bodies. You're out of your mind. <laughs> Am I? Well, there's always another! <laughs> I see you like my watchdog. I really must apologize. 
apologize for forgetting to leave out a beware of dogs. <laughs> from a dragon ninja. Where you go, bodies lie in your wake. And you will join them. Ah, ah, ah. Mizuki. Hayabusa, I'm sorry. Drop your sword, ninja. <laughs> Smart move, Hayabusa. Now. Well, well, not bad. Sudden death is a ninja speciality after all. <laughs> Are you okay? And now for you, Mizuki. I thought you'd never wake up, Ryu Hayabusa. My name is Lovelace, and I'm in charge of the Abysmo Laboratories. We shot you with enough tranquilizer to bring down a dinosaur, you know. You are indeed an impressive specimen. What is this place? Welcome to our virtual simulation environment. We would appreciate your cooperation for a few moments. I won't help you. I'm afraid you don't have any choice. In this simulated space, we convert quantum oscillations into real-time tracing and reconstruction of physical objects. In other words, this space is just like the real world. You can be hurt here, and you can die. I have your friends with me. The woman who shot you, and her daughter. You're dead. If this all goes well, you might even get to see them again. So, shall we begin the test? Masks. They allow one to play a role by hiding one's true face. Your mask is no different. Hero or murderer? Which is the true face of Ryu Hayabusa? The bridge! It's... Run! Looks like you got nowhere to run, yes? We trapped the rat. Open the capsule. Open it at once. Now, continue the experiment. Where are Kana and Mizuki? This time we'll get some. Isn't it just one? Managed to stop the blood. You, you're the ninja! It's dangerous here. You should run. Did you come for the girl? Yeah. Okay. I have access to the elevator. I 
I'll take you down to the lowest level. Why are you doing this? <laughs> Don't look a gift horse in the mouth. I have a little girl about her age. Or she was last time I saw her. After I let you off, I'm going back to her. It's through this hall, right? You traitor! Connor! Are you all right? You're safe now. Where's Cliff? And Mizuki? That woman. Let's go find your mother. Kana, listen. Close your eyes. Don't look at anything. Don't listen to anything. You shut everything out. Where are you taking me? You don't need to know. Where is Kana? Now! Is Kana okay? If you've done anything to her! Hmm. Shut up and walk. Of a god. What? Kana! I was so worried about you. I'm so sorry. They had Kana. I had no choice. It's fine. What do you want? <laughs> the modern alchemist makes the dreams of gods come true. I wish to see the birth of a new world. We took a little sample of your blood while you were sleeping. A dash of your dragon ninja DNA. You are all descended from the dragon god, are you not? While not in this prototype here, it will prove a most useful ingredient when the time comes to give birth to a new god. You know, I think you might add something to the mix as well. Goodbye! <laughs> Prototype of a god. It is imperfect. Born of a warped heart, it stands before you, incomplete, less than whole. Yet even so, it is far mightier than a mere man. Take Kana. Hayabusa. Go! I've enjoyed this clowning around, but it's time to leave. The two of you enjoy yourselves. We'll meet again, I suspect. <laughs> yeah!
You're coming with us, Ryu Hayabusa. You too, Ms. McCloud. What the hell do you think you're doing? You trying to be a hero? We've made inquiries with your government, and they have denied any and all involvement in your activities. I'm acting under the orders and authorization of the Japanese Ministry of Defense, External Affairs. We tried to find this Ishigami, who you claim was running the op. No one knows where he is. But the group was calling for Hayabusa back in you London. You are not the UN! You don't get to go running around trying to solve the world's problems. Your actions are a direct affront to the sovereignty of other nations. That is a very serious offense. You will cease this operation immediately. <sighs> you so-called ninja are ghosts of a forgotten age. These are different times with different rules. You don't belong here. But what about the threat? Enough! Now, as long as we understand each other, you may go. We're rendezvousing with another vessel which will take you back to Japan. That is all. You're dismissed. I said, you are dismissed! I'm sorry about this. About everything. It's not your fault. What happened to Ishigami? I can't get in touch with him. Cliff even tried to warn me. I hope Cliff is safe. Listen. You can't give up hope. You have to be strong for Kana. I know. The truth is, Kana isn't my real daughter. My sister married Cliff's brother and... Kana's their child. Kana doesn't talk much. There was an accident. My sister and her husband were killed. It was such a shock to her. Both parents just gone. So I took her in. It's been over a year now. Kana! What's up? You getting hungry? Uh... <laughs> Kana, you mustn't ask people things like that. <laughs> what am I gonna do with you? We're sorry. We're very, very sorry. No, no. I, I just never thought of being a father. I'm touched. Hey, you! Your ride's here! I'm so glad you're okay. I was in the hold when we were attacked. I just kept hidden in there. How's Kana? She's fine. I'm sorry. I know I promised. It doesn't matter. You're both safe. That's all I care about. Did you hear anything about Ishigami? No. It was just like you said. So what do we do now? First, we need to get home and request backup. HQ might have news about Ishigami. At any rate, we can't do anything else here. I wonder what those Yanks are up to. Whatever it is, it doesn't make any sense. Something's up. Hayabusa, what about you? I must return to my village. I... I need to look into something. Then it's settled. I'll get a chopper to take us back to Japan ASAP. Be careful, Hayabusa! I'll be back soon.
your soul, Lord of the Dark. <laughs> Master Ryu, you must not move. Master Ryu! Please get better soon, so you can start training us again. I feel much better already, Sanji. <laughs> Sanji is the one who found you, Master Ryu. So, you saved me. Don't let it go to your head. Sanji! I'll train with you anytime you want. Oh, yes! Master Joe is waiting in the hermitage outside the village. We should go together. Umitsu. Master Ryu, I'm so happy you're okay. I worked on your bow. Here. Thanks. It's nothing. That's a very strange bow, though. Master Ryu, are you going to see your father? Yeah. It seems the Black Spider Clan is planning something again. You can leave the village to me. Me and the young ones, they can use the training. Thanks, Kenjiro. Practicing. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever beat you. I'm looking forward to our training. Master Ryu. Thanks for waiting. Let's go. The curse pulses tells me 
It has infested your entire body. How do I get rid of it? I do not know. Long ago, there was once a dragon ninja afflicted by a similar curse. In the end, he was swallowed by the darkness. Only his dragon sword remained. The dragon sword was a gift, meant to be used to slay the Archfiend. But it became polluted by the souls of its countless victims. The sorcery cast upon you has caused that pollution to fester and be absorbed into your very body. The curse of the dragon sword is the karmic retribution for all the deeds committed by the dragon clan over these countless generations. There are still things I have to do. It's not an easy thing to live in the darkness. But there are times when we must face the darkness and overcome it. Or else... I have an idea. I've been looking into LOA in all sorts of ways. Some legal, some not. You better watch it. The end doesn't justify the means. So sue me. Come on. The facts are the facts. LOA has built some sort of secret facility in the middle of Antarctica. Talk about suspicious. That must be their base of operations. Are you sure? <laughs> Give me a little credit. You're talking serious brain power here. So, what do you think? Well... We don't have any other leads. So what are we waiting for? I'll arrange a jet. Right. There isn't much time. You know, you'd better wait with Kama here on the ship. You can't take her where we're going. So who's going in as backup? Me. Sorry, I can't be Kama's surrogate parent forever. This time you stay but... with her. I'm a better backup for this op anyway. Come on. I want to play the hero here. So let me. Fine. We'd better get you geared up then. You stay here with Hayabusa. I'll be right back. What's this? Thanks, Kana. I feel safer with this. Hayabusa, the cave entrance is ahead. Inside their base! Got it! Kana? Kana, are you okay? How many times have I told you to clean up after yourself when you're done playing? I knew you had it in you, Ayabusa. Not even the ties of blood can stop you from taking a life. Why are you here? Allow me to answer that. Who are you? <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I am the chairman of LOA. You may call me Ashtia. 
And this is my head of R&D. Clifford Higgins. Sure, I was a contract scientist for the Japanese government, but my true calling is research for the Lords of Alchemy. So you're behind all of this. And you've proven to be our biggest obstacle, Dragon Ninja. And you were supposed to have died in London. But I stayed our hand when Clifford said he needed a sample of your blood. You should thank me, Hayabusa. I saved your life. For a little while, at least. <laughs> <laughs> and thanks to the Dragon Ninja's DNA, we are even closer to creating a perfect being. A magnificent addition to our bloodline. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I am Clifford's grandfather. Connor's great-grandfather. She is a very special girl. I need her. What about Mizuki? Is she alive? <laughs> Who cares? You son of a... <laughs> Your monster brother can kill each other. The death of the Dragon Clan and its outdated ways will mark the birth of a new millennium. <laughs> this base, which means we don't have much time. How did you... Come on, we gotta hurry before the whole world goes to hell. Come on, come on, move! getting more disgusting. You don't have much time. No shit. Just watching us to keep us in check, or if you actually like give a damn. A GPS transmitter? A little much for this operation, isn't it? Are you always going to be chasing us down? <sighs> the CIA is concerned. You aren't allies or enemies. You're ninja, and you're too dangerous. What about you? I just... 
you know. I just want to help Ryu. Okay, whatever. You'll just keep chasing the rest of us. Sorry, Ryu is the only one I'm after. Seriously, what's with you and Ryu? I know him better than you do, kid. Is Mizuki safe? Yes. She's already working on a plan to rescue Kana. Who do you work for? What's your role in all of this, Ishigami? My role? Aren't I the hero? Look, I was as much in the dark as anyone at first. The orders that sent you and Mizuki to London came from above. The enemy had managed to infiltrate our upper ranks. I figured there might be some connection between Cliff and LOA, but I couldn't figure out what they wanted. That's when I went to ground. You expect me to believe that? I don't care what you believe. I did what I thought was right at the time. Why else do you think I came to the ends of the Earth to pick you up? The problem is Kana. Kana? It doesn't make sense. Why would Cliff go to the trouble of bringing her to the Unagi? If he wanted to kidnap her, it would have been easier to do it back in Japan. She is a very special girl. I need her. They may have wanted to get you two together for some reason. Kana and me? In any case, we have to go after them. They're on the Black Narwhal of the U.S. Navy First Fleet. What are you talking about? In 1973, the original First Fleet was absorbed into the Third Fleet. However, the U.S. government secretly reinstated it as a special off-the-books ghost fleet. A fleet that isn't supposed to exist. A mirage. Hayabusa. Mizuki and her sister Saya's father was a colleague and a good friend of mine. I owe him debts that cannot be repaid. I have a duty to protect his family. That was the promise I made to him. Help me. Sir, a message from Langley. The Black Narwhal has been sighted in waters near French Polynesia. Langley? Why the CIA? The signature's just one word. Sea Swallow. Sea Swallow. Sound familiar, Hayabusa? We can trust it. But the South Pacific is too far. You'll never get there in time. Not even at max airspeed? The cruising speed of the F-25 is Mach 2. Distance is 4,000 kilometers. Not enough fuel range. And there aren't any intermediate airfields between here and there to refuel. What about carriers? Are there any crossing the flight path? No, there are no friendly ships within range. Not even a wake trail. Even if we could rendezvous with another plane, without a place to land... There is a way. What did you say? I said there's a way.
Look! Down there! So... That's the Black Narwhal. Hi, Busa? I'm fine. We got a welcoming committee! above one of those escort ships. It doesn't matter which one. I'll try. As soon as I'm down, you get out of here. Fast. Please, Hayabusa. Find her for me. Disable the bow unit, but there are more. You need to knock out all the weapon systems before we can attack. Understood. I'll destroy everything. They're bringing out the big guns. SSM launch detected. What's a trajectory? The target is that ship! of convention and tradition understand. A blood-stained murderer at that. <laughs> Submerging. We won't be able to communicate much longer. Leave this to me. I'll find him. Thanks, Hayabusa. What have you done? You're late, Mr. Scary Ninja. <laughs> Let the girl go. This is the final act, Dragon Ninja. You were always fated to end in tragedy. Is that... Daddy? He 
Alicia. A fine battle. A fine performance. Ah, Theodore, my brother. He was the ace up my sleeve. Her father died in an accident. My brother opposed my plan. He tried to stop it. That's why I had him die in the accident. What do you mean? But there was another role for him to play. To die by your hand. So I brought him back to life. Of course, I didn't need his memory, so I erased them. The mask controlled him through an AI. That's who you were talking to. My brother did love the opera, sir. I wonder if he enjoyed being a dramatis persona. You're out of your mind. Look who's talking. You killed my brother, Kana's father. Isn't that right, Kana? Ah, the curse is complete as well. You know, I was worried that you wouldn't be able to bear the burden. But you did. A true dragon ninja. But it seems we've reached your limit. No, no. It isn't nap time quite yet. Come, ninja. Get up! I said get up! Behold the dragon sword! Pure sin and pollution. Shining with original purity. It is a sword fit for a goddess! Why did you kill my daddy? You... You... you murdered him! It is done. Seven days it shall take. Now begin thy work, my man. Is that? Eagle One, Fox Two. Eagle Four, Fox Two. Prepare to go hot. Weapons free. We're on.
on a JSDF destroyer in the infirmary. You found me? You were out there, uh, floating, clinging to a piece of wreckage. You... those wounds. I don't know how you made it, but here you are. You saved my life. Thank you. I'm, um... I'm just glad you're okay, Hayabusa. Call me Ryu. Okay. Ryu. <clears throat> Couldn't save her. The man in the mask, he was Kana's father. Theodore? It can't be. Cliff brought him back from the dead. And I cut him down. I killed Kana's father right in front of her. She called me a murderer. No! she is anymore. She's gone. That was Kana? Maybe she's going to Japan, trying to find her way home. Then we'll follow her. But in your condition... I made a promise to protect you and Kana. Do you remember when Kana asked you to be her father? If we were a family, we would all be together. Her, me, and you. Family. Let's go. Let's bring Kana home. I'll go tell the others. Hey. The helicopter's ready. Time to go. The giant creature that suddenly landed on the shores of Japan continues to turn Tokyo into an ocean of flame. Sources indicate that the unknown military units that came ashore may be connected to the mystery group that oh, recently Kana. declared war against the world. I can't get any closer! It's too dangerous! This'll do! You heard him! This is where you get off! Okay. I'll see you soon. My sins, as well as your own father. You go. Hurry, Hayabusa. Muramasa! Ryu, tell me, what is that? They call her the Goddess. But she bore the dragon sword. How? Only those with dragon blood in their veins can wield that blade. They took my blood. And the dragon sword. <sighs> she has terrible strength. But her soul is not pure evil. I've heard it said that the power of the dragon sword can only kill that which is truly evil. Even if you get your sword back, you may not be able to finish her. But I must try, nonetheless. Because it is your duty as a dragon ninja? I promised a little girl. Oh, that is a fine reason. 
then you'd best get going. You must have faith in the Dragon Sword and yourself. I have to get Kana back. She's my daughter. Forget it. Keep going. I've got your back. Do you ever give up, murderer? Still you thirst for blood. Even in the state you're in, Cliff? <laughs> See, I kept my promise to you, didn't I? I'm taking good, good care of Kana. Don't play games. Cliff, surely you don't mean... Why? Why, Kana? You really had no clue, did you? It was supposed to be your sister, Saya. But then she ran off with my brother. She can bear to destroy the world with someone so dear to her in it. And our plans for a new world went to hell. But, thanks to their marriage, a better, a more pure specimen was born. Kana! I suppose you should know. The cells of the goddess's body, they came from your sister. Saya? <laughs> Isn't it splendid? Your sister will be the goddess of the new world! <laughs> Cliff, you're insane! <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. I will be Adam, and she, my Eve. The new Eden will be all ours. And you two will be dead. will be the one to die. In the state you're in? I think not. <laughs> Cliff! Behold! The new form of mankind! The old flesh shall be exterminated! <laughs> Do you remember who gave you that bow? <laughs> so what will you do now, you primitive hero? Hayabusa! Did you love her? My sister? Ha! <laughs> no. <laughs> if you do nothing, the world will die. If you kill the goddess, Ghana will die. All things come to an end. Goodbye.
I suppose we should do introductions. So you're still alive? I am. More or less. Theodore. It's been a while, Mizuki. I've got so many questions, so many things to ask. That can wait. First, we need to do something about those injuries. We can't have that pretty face spoiled by scars. I don't have time for that. Wouldn't you agree, Hayabusa? I'll be right back. Let's go, Hayabusa. Connor's in there. Hmm. The field seems to have been cast with high-level Enochian magic. But this cannot go on. Let's go. What are you doing? Now that I'm here, I understand. It's just as Cliff said! We can't save Kana! Not anymore! When she wakes, she will destroy the world! It is your fate to use that sword to cut down my daughter! To kill her! As her father, I cannot allow that to happen. The curse. <sighs> Damn! The grip of murder has such a pain in the ass to undo. You wanted this. It's my atonement. Now. For Kana. The rest is in your hands.
Leaving already? I've done what I came to do. You are not a murderer. <laughs> You're not exactly a hero, either. Guess that's what it means to be a ninja. But, you saved both of their lives, so... Thanks. Mommy? Kana! Oh, Kana! It's over, baby. It's all over now. Where's Ryu? I said some bad things to him. Is that why he left? He will always be with you. Watching over you. Really? Ryu made a promise, didn't he? He said he'd always protect you. And me too. Forever and ever. <laughs>